Iga Swiatek withdraws from the Miami Open. Unfortunately, she will not be able to defend her title. Here's the reason. And Iga has come out and said, it was a very difficult decision to make, but I have no doubts that health is more important. And she said, you know that in and after Doha, I was struggling with a strong infection. I was allowed to play, but a strong episode of tough cough led to a rib injury. We were trying to handle it and continue to play as long as it was safe for me. We were analyzing uh, the data in the last days and my doctor prepared my diagnosis. Unfortunately, I'm still feeling a lot of discomfort and pain and I can't compete. I need to take a break to recover and I have to pull out of the Miami Open and the Billie Jean King Cup. And that's very, very sad. I'm devastated that Iga can't play this tournament. I was hoping that she'd be able to come back after the disappointment of Indian Wells, but it is not the case. She will not uh, be playing any further part in this tournament and she's replaced by a lucky loser now. So it is Julia Graber. She will be replacing her and now getting a bye through the first round and will face Claire Lou in the second round. A little bit here about the 26-year-old, 94 in the world. But that's the news. Eager will not be playing Miami. Hopefully she heals up and will be back on court soon. Who do you think now will take on the reins and take this Miami Open Championship? Will it be Rabakina again? Now that Iga's not even in her section, she won't have to meet her in the quarterfinal. Or will Sabalenka from the other side be licking her lips, looking at this one? She won't have to play Iga to get the title. Let me know in the comments section below. Hit a like, subscribe if you're new, and join us for Miami Open action coming up all this week.